Back of Rusty, and you can join me in trying to figure out the mystery that are that is the lion tracks all over the southern boundary of Gowrie, Maine. Up and down, up and down. Apparently, I've just bumped into Shanae, and she said that they were seen crossing north into Torchwood at some point early this morning. And it just was that they were chasing a herd of buffalo, or following a herd of buffalo at least. I'm trying to find you a nice track so I can show you exactly what I mean. These tracks are fresh, so we must have, I think, maybe missed out on seeing them just by half an hour or so. I can sort of see what I mean. There's female tracks here as well. Let me try and show you. It's a bit tricky here because a lot of them have already been driven over. But we've got a few here where the male went to spray the tree. And in fact, I can smell him. Smell the scent of the male lion. I'll jump out and just show you exactly what it is that I'm looking at as soon as I've managed to untangle myself from scarf slash earpiece. There we go. I think I might be able to get out now. <laughs> All the way from Twin Dams to where we are now, which is sort of between Chitwa and Torchwood. The tracks go up and down all the way. There's fresh set going up this way, so going to the east. There's also this set going to the west. And this is definitely male line, and it's actually fresh because I can smell where he's sprayed on this bush. I'm just trying to see if there's any moisture left still. Very distinctive smell, lion urine. How's this, Chad? Is this? Can you see this one? Perfect, thank you. So for those of you who are new to tracking or new to the live safaris, this is what a lion paw print looks like. This is the back part of his foot, uh, the back pad. And these are his four, oh my word, it's very smelly down here. These are his four toes. And he's going that way. How do I know that it's a male versus a female? Well, just the sheer size of his track. I mean, if we look at Let's, let's use this as an example. It's a nice clear one. The, the entire outline of the track is here. So if I trace it like this, that's the outline of his track. That's the size of my hand as a comparison. So basically his paw print is the size of my hand. And off he went in that direction. But according to Shanae, he then came back and went up into Torchwood, or went north into Torchwood. So, they've just been all over the show, and we've spoken about this before, about the fact that Gowrie, Maine, serves as basically a highway for the Birmingham boys. It's, it's part of the central part of their territory, Hornbills, sorry, not, I thought it was alarm calling zebra. It's a central part of their territory, and they use it regularly as a path from A to B, or in that case from Cheetah Plains towards Juma and Arethusa. And they also use it as a, as a very important scent marking area.